in the box? Let's kill it! Whoa! Pop-ups! Can't we get away from ads anywhere? We believe that you will want to hear about products available from our sponsors. Pretty solid. All promotions in Reality 2.0 are tailored to the buying habits of the individual user. God swallow. I heard that. Take a chill pill, R2. It's just us. What the me hill is going on in here? I'm sorry, the selection Dialogue with Cops is currently unavailable in your area. Please check back later for updated conversation times. Excuse us. We have a reality to simulate. So, what aspect of reality do you control, he who only bleeps? Ask a stupid question. Well, let's give this thing a push. What's the worst that could happen? It turns off the computers controlling the world's nuclear reactors and the entire planet is subsumed in a massive radioactive firestorm? Uh-oh, let's just try it and see. Pop-ups have been disabled for your convenience. Oh, well, that's good too, I guess. Hi, buddy. We brought you a housewarming gift. Permission denied. Overruled. With maintenance routine compromised. Look, Sam, we're two-dimensional. This feels oddly familiar. Holy crap. That's hilarious, bro. Yikes, that dude's bugging. Let's put this new miracle diet to the test, shall we? I found a gold coin. Wow, lose weight and earn money? Where do I sign up? I dropped an entire dimension and I've never felt better. User with control operational. Say hello to my little friend. Hello! I'm sorry, that is not a valid selection. Please try a <coughs> character hype but I'll function. OMG, Sam! Look how cute I've become! You've never been more marketable in your life, little buddy. Don't ruin this. My life! I did a most thrilling life! Someone get that guy a lozenge!
I can't get up there. I'm too small. Well, I guess this is what our office would look like if it didn't exist yet. What? You guys? I swear, wherever I go, there you are! Oh, don't tell me you've become a Buddhist! Say, what have you got there, Jimmy? Oh no! Get away from me! Hand it over, mini jerkbag! No way! I stole this coin fair and square! Now, Jimmy, we can do this the easy way or we can do it the hard way. But personally, I'm leaning towards the hard way. It's mine! Beat it! Hey, Jimmy. Oh, hey, guys. Wait a second. How'd you, uh... I thought I told you to beat it. Well, if you insist... <laughs> Thanks for the coin, Jimmy. See you around. Jimmy's good people. Good people. I couldn't even reach the accelerator. Thank you for your patience. I'm maintaining your height for your convenience. You look lonely. Negative! I am supreme! Gravity failing must hold on! Whee! Sir Isaac Newton must be turning over in his grave. Literally! I... I... I feel pretty and witty and gay! Turn him back! Turn him back! Hmm, near as I can tell, the only purpose of this thing is to generate those annoying pop-up ads. Look, Max! It's-a me, Sam! Yeah! Sell out. Well, if it isn't my recurring nightmare in the artificial flesh, the grinning disembodied head of Hugh Bliss, Hugh, I just want you to know that the way you unashamedly use your personal celebrity to thrust your spiritual beliefs on others is an inspiration to us all. I love you, Hugh Bliss. Hi, I'm not Hugh Bliss. I hate you. Wait, you're not? No, silly. I'm the Internet Wizard. I'm an entirely virtual being, you see? 
but I've thoughtfully taken the form of Hugh Bliss to help you understand my role in your new reality. I still hate you. Okay! What exactly is your role in our new reality? I do just what any friendly neighborhood wizard would do. All of my neighborhood wizards have been evil, so I'm not really sure what that would be. Well, I can answer your questions with cryptic clues, pass out the odd magical item, prophesy! <laughs> Why don't you show us something magical? I'll do better than that. I'll give you something magical. It's not more magic beans, is it? My mom will kill me if I come home with more of those. No, it's your very own rainbow! A rainbow of lead-based color for your car. Uh, you're giving us paint? Uh, 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 not paint. A rainbow customization kit. Oh, well, that's a whole other story. Just use it with your car to express your inner being with all the colors of the rainbow! Some colors not available when prohibited. How does that... Just... Oh, supposedly wise wizard, we have a question. Hooray! Please select your question. You can understand what we type? No, of course not! <laughs> but... I think I'm about to relieve some stress. Can you see our future? Why, yes. Yes, I can. I see. Now, see, I would have phrased that as, no, no, I cannot. No, I mean I see blackness, blackness. How needlessly enigmatic. Thank you. Come How do we win? Uh, what? Win the game. You know, beat it. Oh, no, no. In reality 2.0, Everybody wins! Except the monsters. They die! Killing monsters is right up our online alley. Some are easy! Some are hard. But be careful! If you get hurt in Reality 2.0... I'm all out of questions. But I'm not out of answers! Who cares? Bosco? Is that really you? I should ask thee the same question! Go ahead! What? Ask us the same question! Okay, is that really you? Yes, why do you ask? Guys, it's me, Bosco! I just got my new Reality 2.0 goggles, and with them, I have started the Internet Revolution! For the Shire! Bosco, don't look now, but I think your Reality 2.0 goggles may have hypnotized you. Please! Half-elf rangers of my level are impervious to every form of hypnosis enchantment! Ooh, this reminds me of those internet quizzes where you look at a bunch of shifty strangers and have to decide serial killer or United States Senator. Except we're asking hypnotized or not hypnotized. Listen, guys, I'm perfectly happy in Reality 2.0. I never want to leave. Yep, hypnotized. Now where's my free lap? So how's Reality 2.0 treating you, Bosco? Oh, it's great. I'm never leaving this place. Did you know in Reality 2.0, shelf space is infinite? Uh, don't you have the exact same amount of shelf space that you had in the original reality? Huh. Well, I'll tell you one thing. My money's a lot safer here than in that other... What makes your money so safe on the internet? I got it all in one of those offshore banks. You know, real foreign. Off Does this bank have a name? Well, don't go posting it on the street or nothing, but it's called BancoLavadero.com. Banco Lavadero? Isn't that Spanish for baby got back? No! I don't know what it means. I just know it's safe. If we wanted to pay real-life money to your bank account, how would we do it? It's easy. All you got to do is drive down the information superhighway to BancoLavadero.com and transfer the money. That is easy. Oh, 
And you'll also have to know my top secret account password, which I would never tell anybody for any reason whatsoever. Bosco, we want to transfer a huge sum of money to your bank account. Just tell us the password. Yeah, funny thing. The deposed king of Nigeria was just in here saying the exact same thing. Yeah, but we're serious, and we have guns. Give us the password. No! In fact, I had it wiped from my memory, so they can't even torture it out of me. Then how do you remember it when you need it? Well, just between you and me, I went down the street and had the password tattooed on a certain part of my body. Somewhere no one will ever look. This may well go down as the most ill-advised question I've ever asked, but may we see your private tattoo? No! Besides, I didn't tattoo it on my virtual avatar. It's on my real body, dummy. All right, fine. We'll just go check out your so-called real body. I'm not showing it to you there either. We want to buy some of your virtual goods. What have you got? My wares were designed for the fashionable half-elf, not the brutish half-monster. Gee, no one's ever called me brutish before. And yet, I do have one weapon of such devious simplicity that even an incompetent swordsman such as yourself could wield it. The Platinum Sword of Berserker Testiness? The Enchanted Crossbow of Massive Decapitation? The Pushpin of Eternal Punishment? Nay! The Wooden Long Sword of Intense... Uh, longness. We'll take that long sword, if you please. Five gold coins. Very good. Verily. Here, then, is your wooden long sword of intense uh, longness. Yep, that's a wooden long sword, all right. I kept thinking it would come with a free man-eating python or something. Take care. The enemy draws nigh. He may be closer than you think. For the Shire! Hey, Bosco. This longsword you sold us doesn't work. It does work! Trusteth me! Trusteth me! Uh, nay, it doesn't. Sam, show him. Oops, our mistake. It does work. Well, that was embarrassing. Boy, do we have egg on our face. Bosco? Welcome to Bosco's e-convenience. Wouldst thou like to buy or sell? I think we knocked a virtual screw loose. Wouldst thou like to buy or sell? I think we knocked him clear out of this reality, little buddy. This is clearly an artificial intelligence. It does work, trusteth me. The similarity is un- It'd probably break. Spawn point? What does that mean? Ew! It's kinda cute, actually. It must die, Sam. It and every single one of its kind must die! I need the experience. Entering combat. Blue slime, dexterity, two. Your dexterity, three. You have initiative. Sam attacks. Attack successful. Blue Slime is defeated. That's one less gelatinous monster to spread mayhem across the virtual countryside. Look at its pathetic slimy remains. Almost makes me feel sorry for the little snot ball. Ooh, Blue Slime Slime! Get it, Sam! It's worth a fortune on the spell component's black market!
A fitting location for... Hey, Bosco. Glad to see you've kicked the second reality habit. Yeah, you guys were right. I was hypnotized. I just didn't know it because I was hypnotized. Well, I guess you'll never have anything to do with the nasty old internet ever again. You got that right. Except my bank account, of course. Gotta keep that on the internet where it's safe. Look behind you. It's a three-headed internet. What? Where? <laughs> I think we need these... Um, not really. Well, no. These incessant rationalizations for our questionable tactics do not in all much merit to them. And yet there remains a very real compulsion to say them. He doesn't really need the Yeah, right. right. Yeah. I can see that well enough from Ah, the tw I'm not sure I want him to know. Hey, Bosco. Good day. Look behind you. What? Where? <laughs> Bosco. Bosco? What? What is it? Oh, nothing. La la la. Hmm. Hey, that looks like our car! And then I say we claim it. Hi, I'm the Reality 2.0 Rainbow Customization Kit. I can help you express yourself with a full range of color options for your vehicle avatar. What color would you like the front of your car to be? Blue. Marvelous! Now how about the middle? Red. Excellent! And the back? Purple. Hmm, charming! Congratulations! You've customized your vehicle avatar! Drive safely! Yeah, thanks. Where are we going, Sam? BuncoLavadero.com Ooh, fun! Wow! What's this? I think it's a security barrier. Check sound verified. Access approved. Well, here we are. Banco Lavadero, located conveniently outside the jurisdiction of any significant regulatory body. Say, wait a minute. This is no ordinary bank. Look at all the arrows. This is a devilishly complicated money laundering operation. Money launderers. Ugh, I hate those guys. They always mix in the 10 euro notes and stain everything pink. National Treasury? Toy Mafia? I knew the mob and the government were in cahoots. Cahoots? Is that in Canada? Washington.
Please speak or enter your password. Bosco. Access granted. So his password really is Bosco. Kind of a letdown. It's ingenious! That's the last thing you'd expect! Don't look now, but I think we just gave Bosco a billion dollars. That ought to buy a few cans of reconstituted luncheon meat. I read somewhere that a stack of a billion one dollar bills would be 60 miles high. Yikes! It's a good thing I don't read or I'd be perpetually freaked out by stuff like that. Come on, little buddy. We've had our fun. Let's blow this cabbage patch. Hey Bosco, who's thou? Yes, it does. It's just an AI Bosco. Hot rump. Wow, that rump is... Okay.